Welcome to NCIX Tech Tips. Today we have a very cool thing from one of our partners to talk a little bit about. Battlefield 3. No, we're not partnered with DICE. No, we're not partnered with EA. But we are partnered with NVIDIA. And what NVIDIA has enabled users to do in a way that is a lot smarter than what's been done in the past is find out if their PC is ready for Battlefield 3. So what they've created, I'm holding a GTX 590. Don't worry. You don't need one of those, but it'll provide a great Battlefield 3 experience. What they have done is they've created the Battlefield 3... PC analysis tool. So you just go to nvidia.com, you click on Battlefield 3, and all you have to do to find out is your PC ready for Battlefield 3 is click the check now button. Now, in terms of privacy and all that stuff, don't worry about it. No personal details are collected. All the tool does is it runs with a Java script through the browser. It analyzes your system for pure spec, so it's gonna find out what graphics card you're running. Then it spits out a recommendation. I shouldn't say spits out, it gives you a recommendation for what kind of a graphics card you could buy in order to have a, an ideal Battlefield 3 experience according to the manufacturer's spec. Now you could say, well, Linus, I could have just looked that up on the side of the box and then you know I could see what graphics card I have. Well, yeah, but not everyone can do that. Would you be able to tell your you know, cousin who knows nothing about hardware other than like oh my xbox isn't running battlefield 3 very well maybe i should get a pc which by the way he's right but what if he doesn't know anything about pcs well then this makes it a lot easier so we're going to go ahead and click check now and we're going to see what happens here okay so the gpu analyzer requires the latest version of java that is what happens when i clicked it so i'm going to go ahead i'm going to update to the latest version of java and then i will be back in just a moment all right, so that just took a minute. We've got the latest version of Java. We're gonna go ahead and click check now. Always trust content from the publisher NVIDIA Corporation. Personally, I think they're probably pretty trustworthy as far as helping me decide on a game to run and how to run it and all that good stuff. We've got some other video cards on the table here with me so I can, oh, hey, look at that, that was really quick. Oh, look at this, I have a Radeon card in my, uh, in my display PC. I totally forgot about that. So my face is kind of red right now. Face is red, get it? Uh, so your PC's ATI Radeon HD 3600 series is below the game's recommended specifications, and they are 100% correct. Then what it does is it gives me a little graph here that pretty much shows how Battlefield 3 is going to run at 1920 by 1080, so that's 1080p. That's what this TV is running. And it shows us which graphics cards we're gonna wanna use in order to meet the recommended specifications. So anything from a GTX 560 and up is gonna meet the recommended specifications. And then anything from a GTX 260 through the 550 Ti, which I also happen to have one, there's my 550 Ti, um, up to a GTX 285, so a couple generations older card, that's gonna meet the medium quality specifications. And then your 9800 GTs, remember, that's the same thing as an 8800 GT. There's your minimum specifications, and anything lower than that, you're not gonna be having a very good Battlefield 3 experience at all. Now, remember guys that graphics card is not the only factor. You do have to make sure that you've paired up whatever graphics card you have with an appropriate CPU so you're not going to run into any bottlenecking issues. So if you do have that GTX 550 Ti you want to run on medium quality, make sure you got a medium quality CPU. So something like um, an AMD quad core, you know, like an Athlon uh, X2, Athlon 2 X2, uh, X Athlon 2x4, sorry about that guys. And then if you wanna run at high quality, you might wanna take something like a GTX 580, which is right about here, and then pair that up with something like an Intel Core i7, uh, what's the new one, the 2700K. Overclock that baby, overclock your graphics card, you're gonna have a great Battlefield 3 experience. So, thank you for checking out our little showcase of the GPU analyzer tool, and this is cool, it also works with a wide variety of other games. So just head on over to geforce.com, go to games, and you can find out is your PC ready for a number of different games. And don't forget to subscribe to NCIX Tech Tips for more tips and tricks and other great videos.